Twas the night before Christmas and all through the house not a creature was stirring. Uh, just wait, that's the wrong time of year. Anyhow, it twas the night before boondocking and traveling and we gotta wash the car that we're taking. So, first thing on the list, let's go do that. And then pack up. Well, yeah, I don't like going anywhere without bubbles, bubbles, we have no troubles. Big bubbles galore. Well, actually they're little bubbles, but you know what? It's gonna be cleaner the next day. Okay, good morning, good morning. We're finally up, a little bit late. Actually woke up eight o'clock. She had to make a cake to sell and we're gonna finish up or start packing up the vehicle. So I don't think we're gonna take a boat. We're gonna take the paddle board for sure. Water, all the cooking, camping utensils, like tent and stuff like that. So yeah, you don't need to see this part. Okay, you know, she actually rents out this part. She makes an extra 720 a year just for that parking spot. So that's a good deal, a little extra income. And yeah, here we go. Somebody forgot the keys upstairs to put everything in the car. And that's okay, I have to go get water filled up. And then somebody forgets to grab keys from the house for the car to put everything in. So I think that's most of what we're going to take. And that is our current lay down mattress. So we put this in the tent or if we car camp, car sleep, that is what we put down for comfort. Probably a blow up one's better. So we'll probably fill up the back seat. And then once we find a camp spot, we have to go and put everything to the front seat and put everything down. So that is the thing. We'll have to show you how we do that. I don't know if it makes a difference or if you guys are interested. But yeah, car's washed up. It actually looks pretty good. So anyhow, I forgot to fill up water and we'll do that. Okay, yeah, change of mind. We did bring the blow up, uh, uh, what do you call it, inflatable boat because we might go rafting at between the lakes. So yeah, everything's here, paddleboard, water st toys, everything's loaded up. Not bad, not bad. Our biggest concern on the first leg of our trip was forest fires and roadblocks due to forest fires. Once we got high up into the mountains, it started to rain and that was a good thing. But there was a bad thing, which was sleet and ice started coming down. On the other side of the rain, we did end up hitting a small patch of fires and a lot of smoke. Okay, first stop was to visit my elk moose friend in the town of Princeton, obvious. And you know what? This is about the downtown here. Let's go for a little walk. It's all old style building and maybe one more block that way. Hold on, let's go walk down. What, you want a picture with a mint moose? <laughs> Your picture? Yeah. <laughs> no, Princeton Saints. Oh, good idea. Yeah. Yeah. Princeton. I feel like I'm out of a Wild West mo movie. Mm -hmm. Hey, oh wow, electric bike, Norco. Oh, not a cheap one. <laughs> kind of cool. Check in on the local peoples here. Huh? Some of the locals are out in the boat, wandering around. Maybe he's a gangsta. And of course, a lot of old building. Oh, oh Princeton Brewing. I didn't, didn't see that. Wow, it's a bonus. Huh. 
that is a old hotel or something, I think, eh? At one time it was. Actually, that's a rarity. Huh. Ah, oh, it's a little old Dodge. Oh, everything's for sale. 1964, it's a Chevy. For sale, don't sit. Everything's for sale. What has he got? He's got an old removable hardtop blazer. That's actually rare. Because it's a full removable. Pretty rusty though. Wow. Yeah. Galaxy wagon. 66 Galaxy wagon. Huh. Eh. I used... Huh? Uh, for rent. Uh, look at the old slats. You open up. The old style, they open up and close it. They're uh, scooping water, yeah. Scooping water to take to the fire. Anyway, the garage that we just looked at, they have a for sale sign, 850,000, 840 square feet, four bays. Yeah, heavy rain coming by the looks of it. They need that heavy rain though, with all the smoke and fires. Yeah, this one was half a million, the loony bin. Huh? Half a million? Hey, just like I, oh yeah, it is too. Gold jade, like I'm out of the 1800s. But we can. It's a centerpiece with the flamingo. So there we go. That concludes the first part of our trip going from Vancouver through the mountains of Manning Park. That's a lot of that where the fires were and we ended up at the small town of Princeton. So next video we'll come back, finish off Princeton and head to our camping spot for the night. So stay tuned for that. Hey, thanks for watching. Thanks for checking out our adventures today. Let's see where we're gonna end up. Somewhere by the Okanagans, maybe a winery, maybe on the water, who knows. Until next video, hey, Cheers. Keep staying awesome, my friends.